Judy Collier from Baton Rouge, Louisiana. I have learned that animals are very, very in tune with the spiritual world. As an example, in 2004, the tsunami struck Asia and East Africa and killed over 220,000 human beings, but only zero wild animals died in the tsunami. They had advance warning of the tsunami coming and they rose to higher ground. This has given proof to me that the spiritual world can be in control of the physical world. My only son died in 1996 and I was told by a psychic that he would be able to bring animals where I'd never seen them before. We recently moved to a lake home and our next door neighbor told us that in 16 years he had never seen a wood duck on our property. But that didn't stop me. I went to town, bought a wood duck house and gave it to my husband and told him to nail it up somewhere. He nailed it on the boathouse, not having a clue as to where he should put it, how high he should put it, but he stuck it up there. Within 30 minutes, both my husband and I saw a female wood duck fly into that wood duck house. And this year alone, we have had 47 baby wood ducks jump out of that wood duck house and land in the lake. And this, without a doubt, proves to me that Kyle is very aware that we moved to a new home. He was aware that we had a wood duck house up there and our neighbor is really <laughs> kind of shocked at what happened because I've kind of convinced him now that the spiritual world does play a part in our life. Please go to www.quitkissingmyashes.com. That's my website and you can find out other ways that your loved ones can communicate with you as well. Thank you for listening to my story.